Chora and welcome. I hope everyone has been keeping safe and been kind to one another. My name is Chloe Hitaraka and I live here in the deep south in Waihopai in Vicago. Now I just really quickly need to be honest here. Um, this video thing I am not comfortable with one bit. I have honestly taken about a hundred takes before even getting this far so um, I do commend myself and I really appreciate and thank you for uh, your patience and support um, but the purpose of this video um, I've been trying to do this video all night and it is now midnight and I've had about enough of looking at my face and talking to myself but hey uh, um, the purpose is because I want to share I want to share with you something I found out today and and that was a opportunity I think could change a lot of people's lives and uh, it could set people up to be able to live their authentic self um, live out their purpose live out their passions and that is um, a provider I found called uh, Te Whare Huka Huka, who is a provider who focus on e-commerce online training in a 12-week program um, and it costs seven and a half thousand dollars um, and the mahi is at least six hours a week and it runs for 12 weeks so um, it's a whanau full of um, experts in the industry and um, they're all there basically cheerleading you on your journey to e-commerce so I think it's a fantastic opportunity because this provider is giving 10 people the opportunity to have sponsorship so they have 10 scholarships available um, providing this e-commerce online workshop so unreal and that's what I wanted to um, share with you and part of this process for the application uh, which I am doing and you can too is basically they give you five um, challenges and the five challenges are given out after you've completed the first challenge so this first challenge today for me was I was to um, eye gaze into giving like locking eyes with whoever and wherever whatever all day I was just to lock eyes and um, report back like a um, well basically report back like what I'd learned from from the experience and the results from that experience as well so um, I experimented with it like all day long and I um, I did however I don't know whether I attracted it or what but both sides of my neighbors like stopped and I locked onto their eyes straight away and they talked to me for so long whether it was that they were bored or whether they were actually genuinely happy to see me or have someone else to talk to over the fence um, but I just really found that um, over the duration of the day that locking eyes with um, locking eyes with people definitely made me learn to be more present it made me be more present it made me be more engaged and um, it made me feel more confident and that what they were saying or what I was saying was um, important and um, like everything 
everything else that was going on around me uh, it wouldn't deter deter me away deterred me away from um, what I was trying to what I was trying to do and that was blocking um, a connection um, so you can deeper deepen your connection by eye contact that's what I learned today and um, I think that was beautiful I think it is something that I definitely was a lot more naive about and I mean I do it but I don't consciously do it so um, given the conscious effort definitely definitely will continue to try be a little bit more conscious about um, those learnings and um, yeah so look I thank you for listening and um, I I hope that everyone is safe and being kind to one another and until round two with challenge number two peace night